Kiki leader Main and Jenga. Together with 11 other co-accused for crimes they allegedly committed in Bahati sub-county proceeded for the second day at the Nakuru Law Courts. The 12 accused persons appeared before the Nakuru Principal Magistrate Kipkirui Kipbelion on Thursday or rather on Tuesday where the magistrate in his ruling said there was nothing peculiar in the case to deserve the attention it is receiving and gave orders expected to be followed during the third hearing on Wednesday the 22nd. Chichi Josephine tells us more. For the second day on Tuesday 21st, the man commonly referred to as former Mungeke leader Maina Jenga together with other 11 co-accused persons appeared for trial for crimes that they allegedly committed in Bahati sub-county, Nakuru County. However, after 30 minutes of the court proceedings, drama began as a team of Jenga's lawyers led by Nde Gwanjiro presented an oral application demanding opening of the gates for members of the public who are locked outside, among other demands leading to a brief adjournment of the case. The first request, Your Honor, is that you order the opening of the gates to the members of the public. Number two, that Your Honor, you allow us to stage a protest under Article 3 of the Constitution. The case resumed minutes later but did not take long before yet another adjournment as some of the co-accused persons were missing with claims of that they had been allegedly arrested. We don't have clients. The clients have been blocked. The only client who is here is Maina Jenga because at least he is known. The other that the other 11 we at to jiwa ko api wa me ambiwa na police wasipite zile gadi za police why the police are here i don't know they have not explained they actually stop, try to stop me as a lawyer the magistrate in his ruling noted that there was nothing peculiar in the case to deserve the attention it was receiving as he gave directives that the matter shall proceed in a public field where members of the public will follow the proceedings and that there shall be an extra space and a screen mounted for the public to follow the proceedings and it shall be the duty of the police to ensure orderliness within the courtroom. Also, the police shall ensure there is ease of access to court and no accused person shall be denied access to court. Regrettably, I find nothing unusual about this case. It has been unnecessarily hyped. The case was hands adjourned to tomorrow, Wednesday, 22nd at 9 a.m. for further hearing as witnesses will also be presented to testify. This matter is adjourned to tomorrow, the 22nd of November, 2023. Jenga and 11 other co-accused are facing trial for being members of an outlawed group attending an illegal meeting being in illegal possession of firearms and bang and recruiting people into an illegal group. Chichi, Josephine TV, 47. Uh, that the people of Kenya have won.